you guys want to become a member, there's a lot of perks that are included with membership. At level 1, you will get member badges and emotes that will increase the more members the channel have. Of course, there's a lot more perks like Discord voice chat. There's a join button next to the subscribe button. If you guys want to join, it's also linked down in the description below. Again, big thanks to all the channel members who join as members and go that extra step to support the channel. Huge thank you to King Boo PD, Greenland, and Wolf Slayer for becoming the most recent members. What's going on you guys? Welcome to a new video. So I wanted to explain to you guys how you guys can reset these new massive mass outbreaks. And it's very simple actually. Uh, in some cases you might have to restart your game a bunch of times sometimes you have to keep going until you get it or just restart the game if you don't get it uh, but this is very awesome that you can actually reset the game uh, all the outbreaks so if you want the specific outbreak you can keep resetting until you get yours and keep going like that which is really nice if you get a lot of different outbreaks you can like try to see if your favorite Pokemon are shiny and stuff like that let me just jump on ahead uh, into this. Let me go here. Start up the game. So, it's very cool. This new massive mass outbreaks. Because it gives you an opportunity to very easily complete the Pokedex. Very easily shiny hunt. If you want to go for multiple shinies at a time. You can keep going for the different ones in the entire mass outbreak. So, you can go like, in my case, I, I think you can at least do three outbreaks per try. And if you don't get a shiny, you can just keep going and going until you get your shiny. Uh, the good thing with this is that it's going to be a lot faster to get shinies. You're going to be able to get alpha shinies a lot faster, which is really cool. I like that. So let me, let me start out the game here. So I have saved the game when there's all these question marks. You should not use a berry and save the game. You should wait uh, by using the berry and use the berries later. Because this is going to help you guys not waste the berries because the berries are very uh, very rare if you don't get them you know in the outbreaks so currently uh here's the question marks i'm going to show you guys what these question marks currently look like i just did this off stream or off video excuse me <laughs> i'm totally saying off stream but i just uh, did these outbreaks right now it was a priplop one there was no shiny there so i know it's not a shiny i also tried out the growlith in this one there was no shiny or alpha in that so that's pretty cool. I can do two outbreaks at a time. And the more of these special ones, a lot of people thought that these were guaranteed shiny Pokemon, but it's guaranteed evolutions, which is kind of stupid to make it a star instead of like something that doesn't look like a shiny <laughs> symbol, <laughs> which is pretty weird. But yeah, this is what the current spawns look like. I will show you guys the before and after, of course. I guess we can zoom in a bit so you can see all these spawns here. We got Riolu, we got Growlithe, and we got Priplop as the star one. We got all of these different ones, okay? This is a pretty cool thing. Like, my god, I am so glad that they gave us a free update. They really know what the, the fans really want. Like, new updates for free, that's really good. Um, yeah, very sweet. So, let's set, reset this outbreak. We just go to shut down the game. And for you guys, I will edit this so it doesn't take forever for you guys. Yeah, just for me. <laughs> Alright, let's keep going, starting up the game again. Alright, it takes a while for it to start, so... Here we are, so we are back here in the uh, all question mark outbreak here. Sometimes when you go to the village, the outbreak stays, but sometimes it disappears. So I'm gonna keep doing this if I don't get it right on the first try. Uh, I'm gonna keep doing this until I get the outbreak that stays. So let's see if it's still here. Nope. It changed the outbreaks on the overworld. If it does this, you can just restart the game and try again until you get the right one. I think this is probably the best method to do this. Because sometimes the outbreak stays around, like mass outbreak, but there's different spawns for that outbreak. Because I got two different uh, spawn experiences. I kind of wish I recorded that part, but <laughs> I spent some time trying to reset it, but it didn't work, which is very unfortunate. So, and we can also I'll also show how how the outbreaks will look. I had a stream that did really well. Thanks to everyone who liked the stream, who subscribed to the channel, and hit that notification bell for future streams. Uh, right now, we got the outbreak here. I'm gonna go back to Professor Laventon and get back to the village. 
because I, I got in, in a scenario where the super ma the massive mass outbreak <laughs> was still around. Yeah, it's not there. Now it's nothing there instead of the ones that I got before. So it's always different every time. So make sure you guys just reset until you get the super mass outbreak of the massive mass <laughs> outbreak. It's such a dumb name. They should just call it like ultra outbreak or something or mega outbreak or something like that. All right, let me just restart the game and um, I'll be back with you guys whenever it actually works. Okay, so sometimes when you return, you might just want to walk all the way over there to the village instead of talking to Leventon because you don't have to talk to him. If you don't want to, I think that probably works better because when I did that, I got it immediately. Who knows? It's got everything else but the mass outbreak. I'm getting a bunch of other outbreaks, but not the one I really need. But okay, let's keep going. All right, you guys, I finally got the outbreak back. Finally, it took like about five times to try. I think you should go back and forth from the village to the other areas until you get it. But I got the massive mass outbreak in the Cobalt Coastlands now, which is great. Very nice. Very nice. So let's go here to the beachside camp. And whenever you get this reset completed, you need to save the game in this location. So you save this outbreak. So you can keep going for this one however much you want. So I'm going to save. And the reason I am saving is because I currently have uh, only... 36 and I don't want to waste these berries if I'm not going for a specific Pokemon So you can you only have to use five infinitely you can keep using the berries over and over again Let's see how this one looks You have to reset every time you want new spawns to come in like the normal outbreaks But it takes a while to get this outbreak, which is unfortunate, but you know, it makes sense There's a lot of Pokemon spawning in in this one because there's so many outbreaks everywhere so in this one I got a Sveal, and I got a Tentacool Mass Outbreak that has the star symbol, which means that it's either gonna be Alpha Pokemon, it, I guess it could be Shiny Pokemon too, but it's also gonna be evolved forms of those Pokemon in the Outbreak, which is really cool. So let's try the Sveal one real quick, and see if that one has a Shiny, an Alpha Outbreak, or if it has the evolved form of Sveal. Oh, I guess I don't have Celio. Okay. I thought I had it, but I don't. Oh, can you stop rolling away? Hello? Get back here! I need to catch you guys. I'm kind of scared if there's going to be a bunch of... Oh, there he goes. So these guys run away. That's an interesting choice for us feel. Yeah, well, they roll away. Sorry. <laughs> they roll away. And this is what you can get. Yes! I got proof about it. A lot of people didn't believe me, I think, maybe. Because they left the stream, I think, because the view can keep going up and down. But yes, you can get full alpha outbreaks, which is really sweet. So this is probably a chance for you to get a really good shiny alpha Pokemon. If you want that specific Pokemon. Unless you want to reset and try it for another one, you know. There we go. I got all the alpha spheels in this one. Let's see if the tentacle will give me some alpha Pokemon as well. Or if it's going to be the other alternative option. I'll be right back and... Show you guys what I mean. So while I'm traveling there, I guess I could talk about it. I, I did not expect the stream to get as many people watching as it got. And I guess I'm entertaining. I don't know. I, I didn't know I was entertaining, apparently. Because a lot of people stuck around for a while. And it actually shows that mesh is there. Sorry, I'm interrupting myself. But it shows when the rainstorm might continue or stop. Which is kind of interesting. If I miss any shinies here, it's fine. I don't mind if I miss a shiny. I kind of want to watch though and see if there are any shinies. But yeah, this this is an interesting way to make it a lot easier for some to get shinies. Uh, I don't have the shiny charm, so it might be harder for me to get shinies compared to others. Uh, but this is going to help me actually... Oh, is that an alpha? Oh my god. An alpha, alpha, alpha mantine. I don't have that. I need to get that. So here we got the tentacle outbreak. I wonder if I can use ultra balls on these guys. No, they're all aggressive, so I need to kill them all. It's fine. I think it, it, the only time you get alphas is probably when there's an evolved form of the Pokemon with the outbreak, you know? Yeah, there we go. There, there's an alpha one. An alpha tentacle in this outbreak. That's pretty cool. I kind of wish they used the alpha icon or something like a mix between alpha and evolution. 
Well, they could just do like a split icon where half of it is the alpha icon and half of it is the star icon. But a star icon kind of makes sense, I guess. Uh, I'm gonna bulldoze this guy. It could be possible that he can get shinies too. I don't even know if that's the truth. But I guess we could, we could see if that's the case with this. I think I've always at least got one alpha in these outbreaks. At least one. At least one. I'm gonna go for Luxray. That's a good one to go for against this. I think that's the last one in the outbreak. Oh, there's another one over there. I guess I should just do one one at a time. It's probably good. Oh, the, yeah. The, oh, no. I didn't mean to do Agile Cell. But it seems like some of them are higher level than others. Because they are, you know. Some of them are evolved Pokemon. So it makes sense, you know. Yeah, there we go. A horde, new horde seems to be formed. And there you go. All Tentacruel. So this is the All Tentacruel example where it gets the evolved Pokemon instead of all alpha of the... You might get it like a shiny alpha evolution, shiny, al shiny evolution, shiny alpha evolution, or a, just an alpha evolution, you know? But yeah, I appreciated all the support and all the people who joined the stream that I did today as well when this update came out. So many people stopped by that the video actually got 1.1k views, which is crazy. So if you guys could hit that like button and uh, share this video around, that would be so cool. And if you're watching to this part, thank you. Oh, my Luxray is dead. This is one way you can do it. Just keep throwing stuff. I guess this is the last Tentacruel. Yeah, the reported Pokemon seem to be gone. So this outbreak is over. And I still have all the outbreaks available. I don't think I can finish another one in this video. But you can see. You can get easy like outbreaks. The only scary part about this. Some people might think. Well if I find the shiny. Will I lose the shiny forever? No. Because this is like the normal outbreaks. Where whenever you do the reset every time. And save. Uh, it will always be the same. Until you go back to the village and back here again. And get a new mass outbreak so a massive mass outbreak sorry so you can have a chance in this case i have a basket legion outbreak i kind of want to see what that is but i'm not going to do it on the video uh, i'm probably going to test it out off stream though but yeah i'm going to try go for the reason why i'm i'm staying in this area is because the story mode i think it might be easier to get this outbreak in story mode so i decide not to complete the three outbreaks here i just saved before i got here and I've reset this a few times and I got a lot of cool Pokemon with these outbreaks and I'm hoping to get more Growlithe star ones. I only gotten one Growlithe. I think no, maybe two Growlithe star ones. I'm not sure yet. I think that's what it was. But thank you guys again so much for watching. I just wanted to show you guys who are still around here. I didn't mean to turn that off. Uh, there we go. So oh, that, that, that's showing the wrong monitor, but it's fine. I'm at least move these things out of here. Oh boy, um, I'm gonna have to censor that. Anyway, it's not gonna be a problem to censor. Um, but yeah, let me grab a very quick window here. If it's gonna load forever, I don't know. Uh, I guess I can't show this stuff for you guys. Uh, most people already know how much or on YouTube. I don't think YouTube cares anymore about that stuff. But anyway, content live. All right, this should be fine though. But yeah, here we go. So, here's the here's the stream I did. It was not a long time ago, but I got the, it got so many likes, got one dislike there, that's fine. I don't really care. As long as it got more likes than dislikes, I'm good. But yeah, this stream I did I did like a mass mass outbreak massive mass outbreak shiny hunting question mark and this one got a thousand views thank you guys so much for that that really motivated me to make this video a lot and i really appreciate you guys for liking the the stream and the this video hopefully if you like this video but yeah this is pretty cool i really like this it's very nice it's very nice you know so i got 15 new subscribers on the stream thank you guys again everyone who subscribed on this video this is the most subscribers i've gotten in a single video with without any raids i think I, i'm not sure if someone raided me or not i'm pretty sure no one did <laughs> but yeah thank you guys again so much i really appreciate it. it's 10 times more views than i usually get on my streams so i really appreciate it anyway thank you guys so much for watching
purpose. I want to make more tutorial videos and stuff like that because I know a lot about Photoshop, a lot about uh, 3D animation and stuff like that. So if you guys want to know more about those kind of things, you guys can talk to me uh, on my Discord server. Uh, the Discord link will be in the description down below if you guys want to join. And don't forget to join the super server as well because that's a hub of a bunch of content creators that we have uh, created. So you guys can join that and uh, check out all the other co content creators that are really cool. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. <laughs> bye bye guys. Have an awesome rest of your day. You are awesome. The best one. Bye.